Purdue basketball will play in the Final Four tomorrow night in Glendale, Arizona. It's been a long time coming for Boilermaker fans. The last time Purdue was in the Final Four, 44 years ago. That Boilermakers team then in 1980 included one of the best athletes the Summit Cities ever produced in Fort Wayne native Roosevelt Barnes. Sports director Glenn Marini chatted with Barnes about a Purdue postseason run that's been four decades in the making. They are a very well-coached team. That's what stands out to me the most. And they, they definitely play together. They remind me of the team that we went uh, to the Final Four with. The Boilermakers against the Bruins. Back in 1980, Wayne High School grad Roosevelt Barnes was a junior on Coach Lee Rose's Boilermaker squad that made it to the Final Four. We had the best big man in the country in Joe Barry Carroll. We had some pros on the... Uh, on the wing and this team has the best big man in the country. They have some good shooters around him and they play defense, which is the same formula that we had. That formula comes from a culture of coaching. My first year at Purdue, I played under Coach Shouts. My second year, my sophomore and junior, I played for Coach Rose and then Coach Katie and then Coach Katie transitioned into Painter. So there's been some consistency there in the philosophy and I remember Coach Katie instilled bloody nose alley, so when you cut <laughs> through the lane, you knew you were going to get hit. Purdue beat LaSalle, St. John's, IU, and Duke on the way to the Final Four at Market Square Arena in Indianapolis. That before falling to UCLA. It's a run Roosevelt and his former teammates have recently recalled. And we've talked about it. Um, it's it's, it's kind of bittersweet. We're glad that they're going but they'll never talk about us anymore, so. I imagine you'll be watching this weekend. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm saying Purdue is going to, uh, I don't see North Carolina. I think it's going to be a typical Purdue game. They'll be uh, kind of close for the first half of the first half. We'll get a little lead in the second half will come out, and then we'll end up winning by 10 or 15. I, I think we're going to win the game, and I think we're going to beat Connecticut easily. So you say this is a national championship team. At yeah, it's coming back to the ball. Ball or up? <laughs>